thank you so much for joining me for this video today. So my name is Nicole and I'm a part-time reseller on eBay and Poshmark and um, I primarily do have reselling content and this is kind of reseller, kind of not and I'll explain that in a minute. But today um, I received my second box from Ipsy. I do um, have a subscription to Ipsy and I have um, the Glam Bag Ultimate subscription, which is said to have over $250 worth of product in it, and um, this is actually only my second month um, being a subscriber to Ipsy, and I kind of decided that I wanted to try it out, and last month I actually got some pretty great items that I was able to resell online. So if you are a reseller and you always thought, hey, it would be fun to get like a an Ipsy box, or it's kind of like a mystery, but it's kind of not, because they do email you and tell you what's going to be in your box, but um, if you've ever thought about maybe you would want to resell some of the items if that was possible, I did resell at least two of the items from my box from last time, and I about broke even. I almost just broke even already, and that's just with two items, and I think they say there's like 10 items in the box. So most of the items are full, like full size, but I think once in a while they do send you like a sample. But anyway, so I got my box today. I already opened it, and... Um, I'm really pleased with the items that I got and I'm going to go through and kind of talk to you about them and let you know if I'm going to keep it, if I'm going to resell it. And I do believe that in this book it does say how much each thing is supposed to, supposed to be like retail or MSRP. So I'll tell you that as well. But yeah, let's get right into the video. Okay, so the first thing that Ipsy I think always sends you is some type of bag. And this is the bag this time. It's supposed to be like a marbly. It's actually not too bad. It has this up here, which is nice to put like brushes and stuff in. It's not super deep, but I mean, it's okay for like a traveling or something. I probably won't, I probably won't keep it or anything. Maybe I will donate it or um, my church has a rummage sale every summer. So I might just save it and put it in rummage sale stuff. But anyway, I don't really feel like that's a fantastic item. I really think they, they shouldn't send a makeup um, bag with everything and I think that because if you're getting a makeup bag every time like do you really need that many makeup bags I mean I don't think you do but okay so the first item I'm gonna show you is this hey honey take away the drama youth boosting honey and copper peel off mask so this is it and if I can get it open without ripping the box they say this is a $49 value, which is super expensive. And I do apologize, the lighting's not fantastic. I'm in my, I have a whole room dedicated to my eBay and Poshmark business, and I'm sitting on the floor because I didn't want to be standing trying to, like, pick stuff up. And I don't really have a table by where I, photo, where I photograph or where I video. Yeah, so I do apologize, the lighting's not fantastic. I tried to get my, like, ring light to come down. Um... And it did, but it's just still not. It's kind of like shadowing and stuff. So I apologize about that. But this, they say, is the value. It's full size. It's not a very big full size, but it's full size. And it is a $49 value. It's supposed to clean your pores so much more than other deep cleansing masks. That's what someone said. I don't know. Okay. Um, the next item was the one that I was super excited about. There's a few of the items in here that I know I'm going to keep for myself, and I'm pretty sure I'm going to keep this because it's absolutely adorable. It's called What's the Tea Ice Tea Eyeshadow Palette. It's called the Balm uh, Cosmetics. That's the brand. So the outside is this. It also has like a, a sleeve that matches that it goes inside, and then it ha it's a palette, so it's got, it's got a mirror, and then it has all these pretty colors like greens and pinks and they're really pretty. I think that this I'll just keep for myself because I've been really into eyeshadow and this is like a deep blue and this is like a, a greenish blue color. They're really pretty. So I definitely believe I'll be keeping this for myself. So I kind of decided I wanted to subscribe to Ipsy because I heard a lot of good things about it. I watch um, Ann Eckhart. I don't know if anyone watches her, but I watch Anna and Anne Eckhart, and she always does a lot of unboxings, which I think is fun, and she had some good things to say about this one, so I did decide that I would, um, 
I, I thought, well, I'll try it. And the first month I was really pleased. I got some really great items and I was able to sell two already. So that was pretty awesome. Okay. So that was number two, $36 value. It says the next thing is this works deep sleep pillow spray. Is this it? Or is this it? This is it. Okay. Now, this says you're supposed to calming pillow spray is exactly what your bedtime routine needs. This is a full size and it's $29 value. So that's what the box looks like. Now, I'll take it out of the box, but if I can. Yeah. So that's what it looks like. It's pretty cool. It says it's a $29 value, which is super expensive. I actually think I'm going to try this. Um, I know they say there's certain, it's got a blend of lavender, chamomile, ooh, I can smell it, and vet vetiver, I don't know what that is, but, um, I think I'm going to try it, just because I think that, like, sometimes I have a hard time falling asleep, and I think, like, a, like, a really pleasant smell would probably make me more relaxed, maybe, okay, so that was a $20 value. The other, the next thing is a, a Hava Essential Day Moisturizer, which I'm definitely going to keep. It says it's an exclusive of Ipsy. I'm definitely going to keep this because I love moisturizer. I put moisturizer on every day. I have pretty dry skin, especially in the wintertime. My skin is really dry, especially like up here. And I'm definitely going to keep this for myself to moisturize. I, right now I use like Dove moisturizer. That's all I use. But that says it's a $67 value. Woo! That's a lot of money. I hope I don't like it too much because I'm definitely not going to want to pay that for it. Who pays that much on something that's like replenishable? I don't know. Okay. This is, this says it's a full size but it's a tiny little thing. Touch Flesh Highlighter Balm in Pinky. This is the box. Um... says you can put it you can put it under makeup or over makeup okay I've never used like I've never done contouring or anything like that I know people love that but yeah I don't do the contouring but this is supposed to be like a highlighter so it's almost like a pinkish definitely like a pink color and it's shimmery it says it's a full size I don't know about that and it retails for $18 for this little thing $18. So this next thing I think I'm going to keep for myself. This is Tarte, which I like Tarte. Um, it is an easy on the eyes clay liner. This is a clay liner. Tarte. Tarte. Um, I use black eyeliner, so I'm definitely going to keep this. That's the only color I use, basically. That says it is a $19 value. Now, it's a clay liner, so it says smooth clay glides on easily with zero skipping or tugging, and the formula is totally waterproof and stays put for up to 16 hours, even on your waterline. Ooh, I'm gonna try that. I think that's like right here, and definitely never stays on there. So I don't even do it anymore, but maybe I'll try with this, and if it will work, that would be awesome. Okay. So that is some great items. And I have like six more. Okay. Next thing is Beet Plus Vitamin Serum Shot. I don't know what that means. Refines pores and smooths rough skin. Vegan. Free of alcohol. Parabens. Cruelty free. Synthetic dyes and fragrances, so it's supposed to be natural. Okay. Okay, so it looks like this. So, it, it smells good. Wow, I can smell it outside. Okay. Um, what you do after cleansing and toning, apply serum shot on face with a gentle tapping motion to absorb. Follow with a moisturizer if desired. Yeah, I, I like this. It smells good. My husband will hate it because he hates different smells, but 
Um, that's interesting. So you just like put it and you rub it on your face. I might keep that for myself too. This is a $20 value, so it's not terrible. You could buy this again, and I don't think you use very much at a time. It'll probably last a long time. Okay, next thing is, wow, this thing's heavy. Liquid Lash Extensions Mascara in Brin, which looks to be a, a blackish color. It looks like it's black. Rich black, yep. Okay, I don't want to rip like the box in case I want to resell it. That's why I'm not like opening stuff either, because if I resell it, I don't want to open it. Like open the item, open the item. Wow, this thing's heavy. Wow, it's like really heavy. And it's like, this is like metal. This is like not plastic. It's like really cold too. I don't think this is plastic. I think it's metal. Okay, so this is Thrive Cosmetics, which I have heard of. Um, Liquid Lash Mascara. It's a full size and it's it's retails for twenty. Can't really see it. Retails for twenty four dollars. Volumizing and Langston's mascara can make even sparse lashes look like extensions. The innovative comb wand separates lashes to prevent clumping. Plus, the formula has orchid stem cell complex to stimulate lash growth and soft fibers for dramatic length and lift. I'll probably keep this for myself. I'm really wanting to keep most of this stuff. But I gotta sell some of it so I can make my money back. Okay, and that was a $24 value. Next thing is the Farrah Brush 160 Face Brush. Ooh, I like it super soft. It's $12 value, so it's not like anything super special, but I like it. That is nice. That's really nice. It's like super soft, like kabuki kind of, and actually this is like great for kabuki. Ka <laughs> okay, it's great for kabuki, like a kabuki brush. Excuse my language. It sounds terrible. Meet the only makeup brush you need to apply your liquid powder or cream, bronzer, and blushes. blushes. The rounded and angled brush head fits perfectly into the contours of your face and blends products out seamlessly. That's awesome. Yeah, that's that's really nice. This is a nice brush. I really like it. Fair brushes. Originally, MSRP of $12. So it's affordable. I mean, it's not terrible. Mark Anthony True Professional 100% Extra Virgin Coconut Oil and Shea Butter, butter Leave-In Conditioner. This thing, I want to keep everything this time. Last time I didn't only wanted to keep a few things. This time I want to keep like everything. So it's a leave-in conditioner. Free from sulfates, parabens, and flalolates. I don't know what that said. Um... You just leave it in, detangle, and hydrate dry, ha hydrate dry, damaged hair into soft, smooth, healthy looking hair with biotin. Salon created with a salon approved 100% extra virgin coconut oil and shea butter. Hmm. Mark Anthony. Originally, oh, this is just a sample. This is just a sample one. So, I don't know what it would originally be. It doesn't say on here. But, Okay. I'm almost done, guys. I only have a couple things. Next thing is Pretty Woman Nail Polish and Don't Be Jelly. Um, this is a full size. It says, I I think Pretty Woman is probably, like, not just whatever brand. I don't know. This is a purplish color. Like a purplish, because I have a red on, you see. Okay, the only thing I'm not liking about Ipsy is they said, what colors do you normally wear on your nails? I put red, because it's true. But, like, every color they've sent me the last two times. Okay, I shouldn't say every color. I've only had two months of Ipsy. But, I'm like, I want a different color. So, I got another one that's, like, a reddish color. And it's my own fault. I'll have to go in. I think you can change your profile a little bit. So, originally $7.99. This is a full size. So, I mean, it's a pretty color. But, honestly, like, I have a ton of Estee Nail Polishes and... I have this color, basically. 
Okay, last thing are a VET or a VET Daily Fresh Squeeze Sheet Mask Duo in Grape and Lychee, 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 I don't know. Um, it says their full size value is $8 for both. So they're $4 each. These are the ones that like are like a masky thing that you just lay on your face and you just take it off. It's not like a wash off thing. But yeah, so I got some of those last time too and um, I haven't sold those yet, but maybe I'll kind of put them all together. I don't know. I put them up, but I didn't sell them. So overall, am I happy with this box? Yes. I like a lot of the stuff in the box this time, even more than last time. And I was happy and pleased with it last time. Um, would I buy it again? Yes, I'm, I'm going to keep subscribing because I really like it. And honestly, it's really fun to try new things. And if I can resell some of this, then I can um, definitely make my money back and still have, like, basically have free products. So if you are a reseller, this might be a great idea for you. Um, if you're not, then it might be a great idea for you because you might really like getting all these products. This is like the $50 one, so um, it is more expensive than the regular box. So please take, take that into consideration. And I, overall, am really liking Ipsy, and I hope that I continue to. Um, yeah, so thank you so much for watching this video. I really appreciate it. Hope you got a few laughs out of it. Um, I went through the box, like, one time quick, but the second time reading through everything just made me like it more. <laughs> anyway, thank you so much for watching. Please like and subscribe if you're interested in seeing more content like this. And if you're interested in seeing my review of my first Ipsy box, I will link that here as well so that you can uh, check that one out. Thanks so much for watching. Bye!